so uh, here we are at the Steeville, 59 meter collection of the Sea Shepherd Conservation Society, which is used in the direct action against uh, whaling, illegal fisheries activities, etc. Um, the vessel was built in 1975 and formerly served as a Scottish Fish Fisheries Protection Agency Conservation Enforcement Patrol Boat. Um, sea Shepherd had originally christened the vessel the MV Robert Hunter after Canadian Robert Hunter, co-founder of Greenpeace, but it was re later renamed in honour of the Crocodile Hunter star St Steve Irwin on December the 5th, 2007. Irwin had considered joining the vessel on a voyage to Antarctica shortly before his death and uh, the renaming was endorsed by his widow Terry. The ship and its crew and their efforts for conservation are subject of the Animal Planet show Whale Wars, which is, uh, I haven't seen it, but it's supposed to be quite good. Um, so here we are at the, on the bridge. Uh, it was pretty windy that day when we were there. Just getting across, and we're getting told about how the boat's been down to Antarctica and got knocked around by huge waves. And uh, <clears throat> basically, it's a huge steel bucket. It's quite um, quite high off the water, and of course, when you want to, if you're if you're on it, it's it's all the way down to get to the the quarters where the uh, where the crews sleep and, and eat and all the rest of it. Here we are going down the stairs. There's whale wars and we're coming into <coughs> the um, recreation area for the crew. Uh, only the captain has a room to himself. Everyone else has to share. So usually it's two or three guys to um, to a room. I'm not sure how many crew the actual Steve Irwin can hold, but um, yeah, we waddled our way down three or four slots, flights of stairs, and uh, then got another presentation on a video um, about some risky escapades of the Steve Irwin. So here we go, Austin's on the way there. We're going through the charts of the boat. All the bits and pieces that make it work. So it's the engine room. And go, yes. Going down some more stairs. And we're probably at this stage only halfway down the boat. I would say there'd be another two or three flights of stairs down to the engine room. Here I'm <laughs> photographing Stop. around the recreation area, but obviously try, not trying to get people's faces because you know you're not supposed to film people without their permission. So respectfully, uh, you're seeing all their shoes. So we're all settling in, and after the presentation, we're heading back up. The th uh, probably about three flights of stairs out through back through the bridge and off the boat and it was a huge privilege to actually be on this ship that's uh, doing so much um, and the next mission is going to be associated with the um, what's going on in Bass Strait with the uh, BP uh, 